Hey, Mitria! Don't just stand there blankly. I did not expect. We're really sorry. Come on, you two. Raise your head up. I should have told you that head day no much sooner about everything. I didn't want you to find out that way. I understand if you never want to talk to me ever again. I am a pig and just the worst. I just wanted to say in person that I am so sorry for making you so mad, Uraraka. The face you were making. How happy you looked, Deku. I've never seen you make such a face with. Of course, Elle was totally shocked when I found out about you two. Seeing you guys doing it, I think it's a little different from anger. But I was more concerned about... So I realized it was Aceto that could make you that happy. Then I thought the reason Deku was distant recently was that maybe he is now sick of me. No way, Uraraka. I'd never... Trust me. Don't cry, Uraraka. Right. If you need to blame someone, it should be me. I am the reason this all happened. When found out about Maidariah's quirk, I wanted it all to my own. So I used my quirk to force him into needing me. But Maidariah never forgot about you. Even when he was with me, he kept thinking of you. A text came from Uraraka. He never meant to do any of this hurt you. Still, that doesn't change the fact I did something terrible. Oh, shut up for a second, Maitreya. Both of you, please stop. I don't want to blame anyone. I just don't want any more secrets between us. So please promise me that you won't lie or trick me again. You're a Raka. If you do, I'll try to understand this situation, this relationship, how can you be so forgiving and so kind? It'll take some time, but let's think about how this is going to work for us, all three of us. I'm so sorry. You're such a good person, and I made you cry. Oh no, it's okay. I'm fine. I have to make it. I'm going to help you get it all back. I'm going to help you get it all up to you today. Wait, Aceto! I think that is a bad. No, don't look. Come on, you said no more secrets, but I... Sometimes when we get too carried away, we lose track of time and end up almost late to everything. Sorry, sir, I overslept. You guys barely made it. What happened? My clock broken. We lose track of time and end up almost late to me, too. All of you. Jeez, you guys are unbelievable. Let's continue class, students. Hey, you guys see Midoriya. Oh, sorry, we have no idea. Here, take this. It's a present for you both. Are you sure we can have these? That shop looked expensive. No, totally fine. After I got into school, so many things have happened to me. But because of you both, I feel like I was able to push on further without to give giving up. And as a thank you, I wanted to give you two something nice. Thank you, Deku. I guess now it's our turn to give you something in return. I can't wait to put them in my album when I get home. Oh, thanks, Ochako. Before we start, Ochako has something to show you, don't you? Well, I do. It's just... Actually, falling for this... Maitaria's just, uh... He's nothing but, uh... I'm sorry. I got a little excited since I haven't seen you outside school in a while. I thought my heart was gonna explode. I was expecting to see you at DQ's house. But it seems like your butt's gotten a lot better now, right? Since you're buying toys again. Yeah, although I sure had a rough time during the exam week. 
Anyway, did you buy new clothes, Mina? You look so pretty. Super cute. Oh, this dress. You know, I was just trying some things out it. Doesn't look weird on me, does it? You look amazing. I bet DQ will like it too. Oh, stop it. I didn't wear this for him, you know. I didn't ask who it's for, though. Oh, right. We didn't push the button yet. Stupid me, right? After that day, Mina has changed a little. I realized Mina has been looking at DQ differently when I saw her jumpy reactions and doing things she usually never did. I felt complicated. Not really that sad or angry in particular, but rather worried. How do you feel, Deku? About Mina? About me? About our relationship? Do you have anyone you like? Someone you want to date? Be your girlfriend. And so, if he ends up picking one of us, what'll happen to the one who gets left out? Hey, oh, Chaco. Do you have any thoughts like this, Mina? Since we're here a little early, or is it just me? Why don't we surprise Midoriya a little bit? I have to ask. I want to know. Tell me how you fell, Mina. Hey, Mina, I ask you something. Be quiet. Look over there. Huh? Is that DQ? It looks like he's being attacked. Stop right there. Step away from him or we will attack. You two? What the hell are you doing? <laughs>